Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'll be showing you how to transform into the timeless Audrey Hepburn. So let's get started. First step is to apply foundation all over. Next, apply a sculpting concealer under your eyes and blend it in to brighten the eye area. Grabbing a dark brown matte eyeshadow or eyebrow powder, fill in your eyebrows to be thick and pin straight using concealer to really mold and emphasize the shape. Audrey's eyebrows have changed dramatically through the years, but the eyebrow shape she's most known for is what we call now the Korean eyebrow shape, which is often sported by K-pop stars today. Moving on to eyes, grab a natural peach eyeshadow and dust it along your crease as a base color. Then grab a chocolate brown eyeshadow and line the deepest part of your crease to add depth. Grabbing the concealer once again, carefully trace and fill your eyelid to give off the illusion of deep set eyes. Then grab an off white eyeshadow and pat it down over the concealer to set it. Finally, use the brown eyeshadow to outline the concealer to complete the illusion. Next, grab a pearly highlighter and apply it to your brow bone with a heavy hand to give off the subtle illusion that you have a higher brow bone. Then grab a black gel eyeliner and apply a thick mini cat eye. Audrey had many eyeliner looks ranging from thick cat eyeliner like in Breakfast at Tiffany's to very thin eyeliner like in Roman Holiday, so this step can be improvised, but I recommend going for a thick cat eye to really mimic her large almond eyes. Next, apply a pair of wispy tapered eyelashes to open up the eyes. Then grab a medium brown eyeshadow and line your lower lash line. Then apply white eyeliner on your waterline as Audrey never ever missed to make sure her eyes were well defined and sparkled on camera. To complete the eye look, apply mascara to the top and bottom. Moving on to the face, apply a peach blush to the apples of your cheeks for some color. Then apply a bronzer to your cheekbones to make the face appear more sharp. Going back in with the concealer, trace out the front of your face and under your cheekbones to further enhance the sharp look we are going for.
Moving onto the nose, grab the same bronzer and trace out your nose bridge, and then trace out the back of your nostrils. Next, apply concealer in this exact shape to get the appearance of a thinner nose bridge that tapers out wider at the tip, like Audrey's nose. As a finishing touch to really bring out the nose shape, apply bronzer to the bottom of your nose tip in a V shape. Next, grab the highlighter you use for the brow bone and apply it to the tip top of your cheekbones. Lastly, let's move on to the lips. I am using an orangey red lipstick as this shade was one of her favorite lip shades to wear, but first I'm just using any random lip liner to sketch out the lip shape. Her lip shape was also ever changing, so I personally just chose to recreate one of her most natural lip looks. So, here is me before, and here is me after. So thank you guys so much for watching, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe so I can see you in my next one.